So, I have one word. One word to sum up all the things in the world that are truthful. Truthful, beautiful, noble, virtuous, just and pure. I would choose the word sexy. <laughs> I'd say sexy like, like it was something more. And all the obscene and raunchy things most people make it to be, it would be the perfect word to praise how the right combination of warm sun rays, the sound of waves washing on the beach could roll you softly to sleep. And as the rain would serenade us with the Miles Davis intricate melodies on our window panes, we were named the song sexy. Sexy is righteous sacrifice, something so blindly Christ-like, like learning to be mighty yet meek, like trying to describe how liberty sounds through a saxophone mouthpiece. I swear to you, she even sings when she speaks. So sometimes you just gotta stop and listen for her carefully. But you gotta be quick to catch her, because she might only come in flashes, like last second Hail Mary passes with prayers attached, like trying to catch a quick glimpse of her from the corner of your eye as she goes by, or like sensing a slight change in the air before you're even aware she's there. Sexy has a strong mind and arms. The thing hard and work smart can handle hardship like it's no problem. Bet she make a great mom. Calm center in a swirling storm of tempers using a single sentence to silence it, gracefully creating a climate of contentment where every tear cry dries quick. There's just something in that smile. Wipes them right off a child's face and leaves in that complete ease now. Now don't act like that's only sexy to me. That's sexy like Proverbs 31. She laughs at the future. The time to come, I call it a virtue worth more than rubies. True beauty. Like gold medals when the dust from years of training settle. Sort of like Michael Phelps. Did you know he only swims, eats, and sleeps? That's sexy. <laughs> <laughs> no broke back, though. More like, more like grown men who love each other like Brothers can say so without no homo. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but if they are gay, I really got much to say. See, I ain't sinning. So in reality, we, we ain't so different. It's just that I've been redeemed. Redeemed, charged to create for love's sake. And they tell me that's hard work, and I know. But it's the heart's greatest artwork, so our sexy is expressed from the inside out. Sometimes it's a love and rebuke. You know, that friend you got way scared to tell you when you're acting stupid. It's the beauty of poetry and how we speak life to the people who need it and change destinies by telling people to stand up on their feet, take their circumstances by the car and make them into opportunities. Sexy is taking all the evil things they call to as compliments, using every rock they throw to build mansions with. It's unplanned and unwanted babies growing up to change the world as if to say, my God, don't make mistakes. It's apex. Is in, is in bleeding, bringing healing, like, like the holes in the palms of a sinless king who are down the tree for the sake of his enemies, like ladies with hair made great with wisdom, who have learned to love the bodies God has given them. I'll bet you they know that charm is deceptive, and that beauty fades for the woman who fears to lord, is sexy, and will be praised. Thank you. <laughs>
I can't save you. My frame may be bigger than yours and bear a little more, but we're still the same. My planks are rotting, my floorboards creak, and the termites keep biting holes in my walls. I need help. They tell me the search for God. I hear he can solve all our problems. Wash away the sawdust. We pair our raw hearts, but we've got to walk together. I need you. And I forgot the rest. I. <laughs> <laughs> Come with me.